Greetings, sisters of the internet. My name is C Plus Hill, the hero of VTuber in the making. And today, in this video, I am going to talk about why you should or should not pull for Ruan Mei in Honkai Star Rail. This video is more intended for new players, but I welcome players of any level, whether you're a day one player or not. Without further ado, let's get started with the video. So, Ruan Mei is confirmed to return for Honkai Star Wars version 2.3 that will be dropping later down this month. Let's explain the reason why you should pull for Ruan Mei first. So Ruan Mei, first of all, she is an Ice Harmony unit. She can boost damage and weakness break efficiency. Weakness break efficiency, it's a stat that determines how much a unit can do damage to an enemy with their toughness meter on. So let's take for example, uh, let's say you have a team of Ruan Mei and Kafka and you're fighting against an enemy with 200 points for toughness meter. Now Kafka here usually do 100% damage to the toughness meter for her weakness break efficiency. But for Ruan Mei, her skills allows her to increase your allies weakness break efficiency by 50%. So therefore Kafka would do more or damage to the enemy because now she would have 150% for weakness break efficiency. Not only that, but Ruin Mei can also provide resistant penetration buff for the whole team, and she's also universally compatible with any team you make, whether that is a DPS single hyper carry team, a dot team, which stands for damage over time, follow up attack team, and so many more. And overall, investment in sustain and support unit like Ruan Mei lasts longer than DPS. So, in other words, if you decide to pull for Ruan Mei, she will become a great investment for you for the long run. But unlike DPS who is very strong, they may be very strong at first. However, they do need some kind of a support unit to help pull for you most of your game content and having a support unit at least one or two support units in the team is viable and investing in support can help you in the long run and Rua Mei is happy to be one of if not best harmony slash support unit in the game now with all that do let's talk about the reason why you should not pull for Rua Mei so for new players especially, it is a tough choice to make due to the banner choices. In version 2.3 special program, it was revealed that Ruan Mei's return as a rerun with Firefly in the first phase of the version. Firefly is the brand new character, she is a fire destruction unit, so she's a DPS character. And she's also emphasized our weakness break as well. So if you're planning to pull both her and Ruan Mei at the same time, uh, including their signature light cone, then you might need to spend a little bit of a money to able to pull them if you don't win your 50-50 for all of them. Which is really suck because in Honkai Star Rail, if you lose your 50-50, the next time you pull for a 5 star, that's a guarantee. But it always reset. And... The cost of pulling for a 5 star character can take you up to like up to like 70 or more pulls to get your character or the light cone that you want. And other disadvantages about pulling for Ru Ruan Mei is that you need to build her break effect stat at 180% or more to make her useful, which is pretty difficult things to do. In conclusion, I think in my own opinion, she is still worth to pull it. I think she is a very great support character, work in all kinds of team, no matter what kind of team you make, whether that is for follow-up, dot, or anything. And based upon like what we learned from the version 2.3 special program and what we have currently in the game, the game is heading more into a weakness break oriented niche for the meta. So the meta is definitely changing and it feel and in my opinion it feels like it is going into more of uh, focusing on weakness break. 
increasing weakness break efficiency, building the break effect, and all that. So Ruin Mei, it's a perfect character to pull at a perfect time right now. And Universary, she's just a great support character for any teams you build. But what do you guys think? Are you guys planning to pull Ruan Mei or not? Let me know down in the comment below. If you find this video useful, please consider giving me a like, hit that subscribe button, and check out my other Honkai Star related content here on my YouTube channel. And check my social down in the video description as well. Thank you so much for watching. C Plus Hero, signing out.